Let's take a look at the phonological assembly activity on the aphasia sight reader at aphasiatoolbox.com. Give the client plenty of time to respond, so type in perhaps 999 seconds for the stimulus to be exposed. Next on the word list, cursor down to aphasia phonics, phonological assembly. In this case, let's select the word bean. The client is to remember the word bean throughout the entire activity thus working on verbal working memory. They may want to practice typing it and saying it to anchor it in their working memory. The next screen will present a cue, a young person. The client is to say and then type a word that rhymes with the original word, bean, that means a young person, in this case, teen. On to the next screen, a word that rhymes with the original question, what is that? And they would say bean. The word here would be mean. An academic administrator, what's a word for that that rhymes with the original word, which was what? Sometimes I'll have the client type the word, bean. They need to come up with the next word. If they're having trouble, you can automatically cue them with a D. I try to avoid that, dean. As we move along, I will ask the client, what's the original word, bean? What's this word, dean? And what does dean mean? They can say academic administrator, so you can work, work, start working on definitions and bringing in semantic components. Sharp or eager, keen. So that is the phonological assembly activity at the aphasia sight reader.